Hello and welcome back to Mama Eurovision. My name is Judy Ladivina and I am your Mama Eurovision. I'm FKA and I'm your baby Eurovision. And here we are, baby Eurovision, yes. sitting down and reacting to all of the songs of the second semi-final from this year Eurovision Song Contest. And right now it's our time to react to Montenegro. It's my first year with Montenegro. It's your first journey with Montenegro. They missed the last year Eurovision. Uh, usually Montenegro sends songs which I person they don't do so well, but I think they send really, really, really high quality, sophisticated songs to the competition. And I'm very, very curious to see if this year is an exception or not. So welcome back to the Eurovision Montenegro. Enchanté, Miss FKA. And whenever you're ready, let's get into it and roll the tapes. Hold on. Breathe. 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 A window. A light. So many videos started that mm -hmm. this year. Come through Mystery. production. Very church. Just to make you mine. My mountain feels the same. You fear only when rain. The battle for the light is fierce and enough to act so selfishly. His unforgiveness. Has you written all over it? Me. She has a beautiful voice. Lots of presence. Like, mm -hmm. I'm curious to know where it goes though. It's a very interesting visual for sure. It's not the first time I say it, but the chorus is me downgrading the, the me whole the package. Yeah. But it should work the other way around. Chorus should be the thing that hooks you up. Mm. It builds up. Let's see if it lives up to the build up. The chorus is losing me. That's okay. Um, the chorus is losing me. Everything after the first verse is losing me. She is very powerful. Your attention is grabbed immediately. The voice, the eyes, something there is so, mm -hmm. so right. Mm -hmm. But then once the chorus drops, it's like over trying. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Lots of beats that should not be there. Mm -hmm. uh, and I feel the song goes into a way where it shouldn't go. I would rather it to be a power ballad through and through and through without this over trying part. 
um, borderlining borderlining qualifier for me yeah. at this point for Montenegro. Although you are an incredible singer. It's just another example of two songs in one. You can literally split split it down the middle and it could be two completely separate songs. I think from this beginning it had so much potential to start with. I mm. love the drama of the opening. I thought it was really, really going somewhere. That's why I said it's very you. And then the chorus kicked in and from there onwards it was just like a very downward slippery slope. Well, that was Montenegro, and this is our time to give Montenegro our points. Baby Eurovision, what would you like to score Montenegro? It's going to be five points. It's going to be five points from Baby Eurovision to Montenegro, and from Mama Eurovision, it will be three points. Um, yeah, it was going there, and that's the worst. If you take mm -hmm. me and then there's nothing yeah. to see. Um, However, I love you, Montenegro, and I wish you all the best. It's not personal, mm -hmm. it's only drag. And maybe it would grow on me. Hey, it's just the Let's first see. time we listen to it. Please let us know, guys, what do you think about Montenegro's entry this year at the Grand Eurovision Song Contest? I was about to say Grand Finals, but clearly I did <laughs> not because I don't see that in the finals. But maybe you do, and you should explain why, because we would love to know. You can also click the like, share, subscribe button, because... Why not? It's for free!